The containment policy, also known as the Truman Doctrine, was a strategic approach adopted by the United States during the early years of the Cold War. It aimed to contain the spread of communism and prevent its expansion into other countries. This policy was developed in response to the growing influence of the Soviet Union and its aggressive actions in Eastern Europe and elsewhere. The containment policy was first articulated by President Harry S. Truman in a speech to Congress in 1947. He emphasized the need to support countries facing communist threats and provide them with economic and military assistance. Truman argued that if these countries were allowed to fall to communism, it would create a domino effect, leading to the spread of communism to neighboring nations and beyond. Under the containment policy, the United States implemented various strategies to counter the Soviet Union and its allies. One key component was the establishment of alliances, such as the North Atlantic Treaty Organization, NATO, which aimed to create a collective defense against communist aggression. The United States also provided military aid to countries like Greece and Turkey, which were under threat from communist insurgencies. Another aspect of the containment policy was the implementation of economic assistance programs. The most notable of these was the Marshall Plan, which provided billions of dollars in aid to help rebuild war-torn European countries. The goal was to create stable and prosperous nations that would be less susceptible to communist influence. The containment policy also involved diplomatic efforts to isolate and weaken the Soviet Union and its allies. The United States engaged in diplomatic initiatives, such as the establishment of the United Nations, to promote international cooperation and undermine Soviet influence. It also utilized propaganda and psychological warfare to counter communist ideologies and promote American values. The containment policy had a significant impact on the course of the Cold War. It helped prevent the spread of communism in Western Europe and successfully contained Soviet expansionist ambitions. However, it also led to military interventions and conflicts, such as the Korean War and the Vietnam War, as the United States sought to confront communist forces. Over time, the containment policy evolved and adapted to changing circumstances. It influenced subsequent U.S. foreign policy approaches, such as the policy of détente in the 1970s and the Reagan Doctrine in the 1980s. The fall of the Soviet Union in 1991 marked the end of the Cold War and led to a reassessment of containment as a guiding principle. In conclusion, the containment policy was a strategic approach adopted by the United States during the Cold War to prevent the spread of communism. It involved military, economic, and diplomatic efforts to counter the Soviet Union and its allies. While it had its successes and failures, the containment policy played a significant role in shaping the geopolitical landscape of the 20th century.